According to Mr. Krabs, what does a pirate say? Yo ho, ahoy, or arg? Arg. Yep. I don't know how Gary knows he wasn't there, but. All right. Hey guys, it's the Mountain Man here. Welcome back to SpongeBob's Truth or Square. In the last video, we actually uh, headed back. I think that's the right term. Headed. Yeah, headed. We headed back to the to the first level of Fun Times Jelly Fishing with Patrick. And uh, picked up all the remaining collectibles there that were there. Uh, we got the remaining two uh, happiness objects and art packs. And in this level, we're going to be doing the same with meeting Sandy Cheeks. So, let's do so. Yes, please. Right, what crime does Spongebob give Patrick a ticket for? Jaywalking, dripping ice cream, or crying, dripping ice cream? Yep, dripping ice cream. Alright, so let's skip the cutscene. And... <laughs> hey guys, sorry about that. Uh, my, I guess my Alexa thought I said her name and started talking to me and it scared the absolute hell out of me. <laughs> but anyway, um, I kind of forgot what I was saying before I made the cut, so I hope it wasn't important. But let's start this level. Uh, the teleport box is actually right behind us, so we need to just turn straight around and uh, hop into it. And here we are. We're in this section now. See, these robots are back here like, oh, no, now we can't hit them. <laughs> oh, no, they're just like, ah, screw it. <laughs> anyway. So we're in this section now, and if you see up there that little brown deal, there's the Larry Tiki right past, uh, right past, I guess Sandy is right past the, the Larry Tiki, not the other way around. Wow, that really knocked me off course. I kind of feel like I'm stumbling with my words now. Or, or like I don't have something to say to like, you know. Alright, I don't know why I'm destroying these guys. Let's go over here. And pick this up so we can make our way up there. There's the the Wii Yellow Bot right there. That we know it is the Wii Yellow Bot now. And let's spin these before those guys come over to screw me over. And there we go. Alright, so let's hop up here. Over here. Smash these, why not? And then... Jump up here, and here's the Larry Tiki, so let's activate it. Start! Time to get happy. Collect 50 happiness nuggets in 30 seconds, and happiness will be yours. I don't know, man. Sounds sounds a bit... Sounds sounds a little... Shady to me, you know? It's like one of those emails that you get that say, like, do this and get a bunch of money real easy, you know? I don't know. Anyway, here's the challenge. We gotta jump across these jellyfish here and collect these, uh, these shiny happiness objects. You can tell they're different because they... They have like a little glow behind them. Uh, different from the regular ones anyway. Success! Woohoo! That's how it's done. You complete the challenge. Alright, so it's going to fall right over there. Let's get it while destroying all these robots. And Magic Conch Shell. Congratulations. Good name of happiness object. The Magic Conch Shell is going to add to your home decorations. Alright. Well, SpongeBob went like sideways there for a second, did he? Oh, that was weird. Oh, well. Oh, I guess we could get this life down here. Again, we don't really need it, but... Or, yes, like, you don't... Considering we have 99... 99 lives already. Blow that up. Make that fall down. And... Continue on. Alrighty. Across here, blow these guys up, blow these guys up, this, and I, you know, I remember the last time uh, I came here, I remember, like I said, that I had no idea how to get that life, but I'm going to try something now. I thought of something, you know, uh, last time I saw, I saw this level, I'm thinking that maybe, yeah, yeah, look at that. And then I can jump over. <laughs> Holy crap, man. 
you really do learn something new every day, don't you? As long as I've been playing this game, dude. Uh, it's crazy. Alright, so let's not actually jump into that teleport box, but just float on top of it. But luckily, it still works. So, hey, you know, can't argue with results. Alright, so the last two Larry Tiki's in this level are actually right here. Like, uh, you see there's one right there and then one right up there behind the little tornado of dust and these robots. So let's wait for this to run out and then hop up here. And that guy really wants to smash me with his hammer, with his hammer, with his hammer. And start! Test your sponge skills against these Cretans. Use everything you got to survive 60 seconds. Okay, so I guess not all the the art pack Larry Tiki's are... The, the last one that you that you get to, but... Ah, well. Anyway. Come on, where are you guys? Making you guys dizzy. Making myself dizzy. Oh, he almost got me. Oh, that was close. <laughs> Let's get these guys. This guy... These guys. This guy, why not? This guy. This guy. This guy. These guys. Or girls, I don't even know. I was gonna say, I don't think robots have genders, but, I mean, Futurama obviously has taught me different, so. Alright, success! Woohoo! That's how it's done. You complete the challenge. Alright, so once that's over, let's go ahead and pick up the third and final art pack of this level. Alright, there we go. So, now, we just gotta head over here. Jump across here. See, the, the spawn bots have already, are, have, uh, already I guess, bit, not been destroyed, but they despawned. Uh, once we uh, do that challenge, I guess. So let's head on back. And and uh, before I uh before I actually jump up here, I want to point something out. If you go over here and listen real closely, you can actually kind of hear snoring, like the like the snoring of a sleeping Patrick. But there's no sleeping Patrick around here, so you know what, what the heck is going on. But uh. If we go over here, and I forgot about that, that kind of startled me. But if we go over here and turn around, there's actually a hidden, uh, a hidden, uh, uh, little panel for us to hit here. A hidden little panel for us to hit here with our cannon shot. There we go. And doing that will cause this plane to fly over and poop out a bunch of boxes. And among these boxes, among among this particular load it dropped. I guess you could say. Once we go over here. And smash this open. Hint. Congratulations. You found sleep Patrick sleeping in all the levels. Enter 6647 into the cheat menu in SpongeBob's Pineapple. Alright. There we go. Sleeping Patrick number 7. That is the final Sleeping Patrick in the game. We found all of them. Nice. <laughs> Wake up, Patrick. You gotta be protecting the, the patrons at the party. Alright, so there we go. Don't have to worry about collecting Sleeping Patricks anymore. That's nice. Or rather, I guess, finding Sleeping Patricks. We're not really collecting them. Alright, so we got the new code 6647. All we got all that's left to do is to activate this Larry Tiki and do its challenge. Start! If you want a prize, you have to destroy 20 of the Plankton Tiki's in 30 seconds. Are you sponge enough to do it? I don't know, are you sponge enough to do it? I guess it's, I guess it's made of stone, so it couldn't really be sponge enough to do it. Uh, I think, yeah, you can reach these with the, with the sponge buff spin. I'm not sure if you can with the regular one, like you might have to use your cannon shot. Anyway, this one's really easy, they're all right here. And uh, don't go in there, because like if you do, even while doing the challenge, it will like cut the challenge short and activate the mini-boss, so wait until you're done. Success! Woohoo! That's how it's done. You've completed the challenge. And doing that, we will get 
Heart shaped acorn. Congratulations, you obtained a heart shaped or a happiness object. A heart shaped acorn has been added to your home decorations. All right. So, so uh, this, this episode has been pretty eventful. I I started it after having a failed take, admittedly, because I straight up didn't go into the teleport box, forgot that it was there. Then my Alexa, like, uh, oh, I activated her again. Oh, she shut off. I guess saying up, like, made her realize, oh, you made a mistake. But, uh, my, 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 uh, device activated, scared the crap out of me. And then we found, not only did we find all the collectible, the rest of the collectibles in this level, but we also found the, the final sleep of Patrick in the entire game. So, you know, <laughs> it's been, been quite a productive, been practiced. Right. Quite a productive episode, if I do say so myself. So I'm gonna go ahead and fight off, fight up, fight the final boss again. So I'd like to say thank you guys for watching. See y'all next time, and I will meet you back in the pineapple. See ya.